for the past six years, seven, seven years of having this channel, I, I haven't been truthful to all of you are. I haven't revealed myself fully to you as my audience. There are things that I have wrongfully kept secret from all of you, and it's unfair. It was unjustified. Today, I want to make that wrong right and change all that and let you all know something that should have been known a long time ago. That, of course, being that I live a double life. I tried to hide for so long, but I can't hide it anymore. You all deserve to know. With all the humbleness in my heart and my soul, I say, no, that is not it. I'm not just a college student dreaming of becoming a filmmaker slash actor. I live a double life where I am already a famous actor and possibly in the future to become a filmmaker already in Hollywood that has already made it big. This double life of mine, I actually have a different name than so maybe no in my double life. I go by the name of Thomas Sainster. Many of you have probably heard that name. Preferably, you've heard that name as one of the list of names in the cast of the YA movie franchise, that being called Maze Runner. And most of you are thinking like, wait, you mean to tell me, Joe, that you are actually one of the main cast in the Maze Runner movie? And yes, that is exactly what I'm saying. If you don't believe me, look at the resemblance of the actor that you know as Thomas Sainster. And look at my face. And look at him. And look at me. Look at me. Look at him. I'm sorry, I get mixed up. See? That's how much the resemblance is. If you need any proof that we are the same person, then look no further. Imagine it similar to that old Disney Channel show. You know, the one where she's psychic. I, I think it was called like a Sweet Life on Deck. I don't know. Take it on many different roles. That being, of course, Newt from Maze Runner series but as well as other preferable roles where I even started acting as a child actor. It feels good to finally tell you this now, but I need to get through. I gotta reveal all because there's a lot. But in my early acting career as a child actor, I first started out where I got my first prefer preferable performance, the holiday romance film called Love Actually, where I lived the dream that every child dreams of having, and that's to have Liam Neeson as my dad. I was the kid where, like, if it happened in that movie where I was taken, then Liam Neeson would punch some guys and say, well, give him to me, give him to me, I want my son back, I want my son. That could have been me, it didn't. He was just telling me how to score with a girl, but... Still, lion guy, my daddy. Other roles that I have portrayed in my life have also been through voice acting as well. Considerably from a anime television show also in this called Phineas and Ferb, where I appropriately voiced as Ferb. And this is a character that I played that only spoke just a few lines, if not none, at all. So of course, out of all the voice actors, I got the top billing, and I got paid the most. That is, I, there's more I have been hiding from you all, and that is that I am revealed to you who my true 
father is, and that is, of course, the myth, the man, the legend. But many of you might have heard of little, 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 little name that you might have heard of that being, of course, Rowan Atkinson, yes. I know the resemblance is very hard to see. I know it's. But I think you might get the gist. That's my daddy. My daddy. But not only that, all of you are probably wondering yourself, hey, well, what about the ball? I just see if I can get this at all. Well, that, of course, is revealed something that I also haven't told you at all. And I am sorry. I am sorry. But I will tell you now who my true mother is. I'll show you a picture. Here is my mom. But I hope that now that I have come forward to all of you, I hope that we can move, even if slowly, but still move forward somehow. And be sure to see my new film, Maze Runner Death Cure, in theaters now! Oh, God! Oh.